Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Sydney. Um, I just wanted to hop on here and make a quick little video um, doing my very last project of 2023. Um, it's just a simple short project. Um, I had some old fabric left from when I made my son Noah his um, dinosaur pillowcase and um, I had just enough fabric left to make my other son a pillowcase and I'm going to stuff it and it's going to be a little pillow for his bed. Um, so yeah, I'll flip you guys around and show you what I'm working on. Okay, so what I'm working on, um, this is the inside of the pillowcase, but I'm currently, I've got the sides pinned. I'm just going to sew all the way around all of these edges and then I'm going to take my polyfill stuffing that I have um, an abundance of and I'm going to stuff it. And that'll be my very last project of 2023. I'm hoping then, it is literally New Year's Eve, I'm hoping to get this done by midnight. We'll see. Um, but yeah, I just... I wasn't going to do a last minute project for the end of the year, but I figured it's New Year's Eve. I might as well squeeze in one more um, just to end the year off. So yeah, I will uh, keep you guys posted on how this is going. I'm going to go ahead and finish up sewing all the sides and then I'll flip it around and show you what it looks like before I stuff it. All right, so what I've done, I went ahead and I got all four corners of the glove sewn up. Um, so you can kind of see the little dinosaur shapes on it. Um, this is still the outside of the pillowcase. So I'm gonna flip it around. Um, I got out a hole. I didn't sew up the hole. So I'm gonna flip it inside out and then um, I'll show you guys what it looks like and then I'll stuff it. And it's a really cool fabric. Um, if you guys do get the opportunity, I would definitely go to Joann's. Um, this is like their, I don't even know if they still have it anymore. It's been a while since I bought it, but it glows in the dark. Um, it is the coolest fabric. Um, and my son loves it. So I figured I'll make one for my other kid. Um, but shake it out here. Yeah, the little dinosaurs all over it. But I figure he's only 18 months old. So it's not going to be a big pillow. It's going to be like, I don't know, maybe like the size of a little throw pillow pretty much. Um, but I figure he doesn't need a huge like queen size pillow at this time. So we'll just give him something um, to kind of cuddle with. So yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Now I'm going to go ahead and stuff it and then I'll do a ladder stitch to finish it off. I wanted to show you guys the type of um, stuffing that I'm using for my pillow, so I'll flip you around. Um, so I'm using this, I get this at um, Hobby Lobby. Um, it's typically like $2.99. Um, I just use the polyfill, I do the 12 ounce because um, it's for pillows and stuff. Um, when I was doing my like baby pillows for like my boppy pillows, um, I really like this type of stuffing because um, it's really good and it holds up. So um, I used that on my son's nursing pillow when I made and I still have it and it still is, you know, I've washed it probably, I don't even know how many times, but it still holds up. So yeah, and that's all I'm doing is I'm just taking it out and stuffing it in the hole and then um, I'll sew it up at the end. So I'm going to get back to stuffing it. Okay. So now what I've done is I went ahead and finished stuffing it. Um, like I said, it's going to be about the size of a throw pillow. Oh, here, let me flip it around so you can see the dinosaurs. Um, it's really not that big, but um, he's just a little guy, so he doesn't need much. Um, now I'm going to go ahead and grab a needle and thread and I'm going to do a ladder stitch um, to uh, sew up this hole. And then I'll show you guys when I'm done. 
All right, guys. So, um, like I said, I went ahead and did a ladder stitch to kind of just finish off the top here. So here is the pillow after it's been um, sewn up. It is just a little pillow, like a little throw pillow for his crib, um, just so he can have something to cuddle with. Um, like I said, he is not a big guy, so he doesn't need like a full, you know, queen size fold or, you know, king size pillow. Um, but yeah, I really enjoyed making this for him. Um, I just had the leftover fabric from when I made my other son his pillowcase and um, I didn't want it to go to waste. Um, I'm going to try to be real intentional um, going into 2024 about de-stashing. Um, as you can see, I have tons and tons of fabric that I need to be going through. Um, so yeah, um, cute little project last year, last like end of year project, I guess. Um, so yeah, it just came together in about an hour and, um, I'm going to go ahead and start on my next project for the 2024 year and I'll, uh, make another video about that. But thank you guys for sticking around. I hope you had a great 2023 year and, um, we'll see you in 2024.